24, season 3, episode 24, 12 p.m. to 1 p.m. season finale of season 3. The last shot is a very memorable shot where 24 usually ends uh, their seasons on some sort of twist to set up the next season. But um, the last shot is basically Jack crying in the car after a very, very long day and a, very, a lot of people dying along the way. He saves the day, of course, but there's a lot of casualties along the way and he just really shows that he's a vulnerable guy and like he can he's a human being he's not a robot and like just showing him crying really some really good acting by uh Kiefer Sutherland here and so that's how the episode ends and uh and that's how the season ends where Jack crying in his car um Palmer decides not to seek re-election he's not proud of himself for all the stuff that he pulled off with uh with the whole Milligan thing and Sherry's dead now. So that scene where like he finds out that Sherry's died, he kind of like freaks out a lot. So basically he doesn't feel like he's a good president anymore. Jack is forced to cut off Chase's hand in order to, uh, to have the virus not go off because the, 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 the virus that was like, they, they, the guy attached to Chase's arm. And of course Jack's got to take an ax and chop off Chase's arm. And like, which was like, kind of like, scary to watch and stuff like that very emotional um the actor chase did a good job in the season never to be seen from again so guy who's in every episode of season three we never see him again just like kind of like kate warner in the season before tony's going to prison for what he did for about 20 years uh solid solid finale without the usual twist but there actually is twists because we're all this stuff between Kim and Chase and like Palmer not seeing re-election. Who's going to be their new president? What's going to happen with Tony because he's in prison now? What's going to happen with Michelle? And uh, we're just going to have wonder what's going to happen to all the characters. And that's where really the twist is. And we're going to probably people argue that season four is probably the best out of, uh, of all the 24s. And we're ready for season four. An uneven season, season three. Sometimes it really bothered me a lot, but it kind of had a good comeback in the end. That's the that's my review. That's season finale, season three twenty four.